Included in Vectorworks are a few default dimensioning standards. However, you can create your own custom dimension standard. To create a dimension standard, first select File, Document Settings, Document Preferences. Click on the Dimensions tab and then click Custom. Alternatively, with any of the dimensioning tools in the Dims and Notes toolset selected, open the Dimensions Standards menu on the toolbar and select Custom Standards from the list. Or, with an existing dimension selected, open the Dimension Standards menu on the Object Info palette and select Custom Standards from the list. If you've already created a dimension standard in another document, you can also use this menu to import it into the current active document. Click New. The Assign Name dialog box opens. Enter a name for this dimension standard and click OK. Select the new dimension from the standards list and click Edit. The Edit Custom Dimension Standard dialog box opens. Here you'll see a graphical display of the various dimensioning types. You can change the distances here between the dimension lines, witness lines, and offsets from dimensioned objects. Below that you have control of the various markers, as well as the text layout, style, and what information will be included in the text itself. We'll make a few customizations here, changing the marker style, as well as showing dual dimensions for this particular example. Click OK to both the Edit Custom Dimension Standard and the Custom Dimension dialog boxes. Now, choose the name of the Custom Dimension Standard you created from the Dimension Standards menu. Your dimension's appearance now matches those you set previously in the editor. To globally change all of our dimensions to the new Dimension Standard, we can go to Tools, Custom Selection. We'll choose Criteria. And for the first set of parameters, we'll choose Type is Dimension. Not only do we have dimensions in this document, we also have chain dimensions. So we'll click More Choices, and for this line, Type is Chain Dimension. And then click OK. All of the dimensions on the current active layer have now been selected. So in the Object Info palette, under Dimension Standard, we can choose our new Custom Dimension Standard. Thank you for joining us, and don't forget to visit kbase.vectorworks.net for more video tech tips and other technical articles. Thank you, and have a great day.